In the modern world of gearing, customers demand higher accuracies for certain applications, requiring the measuring of numerous gear parameters and an understanding of how to read the charts and data that result from that measurement process. Gear accuracy, synonymous with the term gear quality, is designated by a flank tolerance class. The allowable tolerances that relate to each class are calculated based on formulas specified in the relevant industry standards. Design engineers use these standards to define the gear accuracy class required for the specific application on the engineering drawings. The gear accuracy levels assigned to gears as a result of the measurement process help design engineers to communicate the design intent and allow manufacturing companies to tailor their processes to ensure the right quality parts are produced. The factors that define gear accuracy are classified into three main groups, elemental, composite, and size measurements. Elemental measurements are obtained through analytical quality inspection of the different geometry parameters of pitch deviation, profile deviation, and helix deviation using manual or automated or computer-controlled gear measuring equipment. The measured deviations are then evaluated according to the standard, and the worst one determines the accuracy grade. The gear inspection reports, or simply gear charts, provide a visual representation of how the gear tooth geometry differs from the intended design. Gear measurement charts can be produced by dedicated gear measurement machines or coordinate measuring machines, or CMMs. More recently, some gear grinding machines are equipped with onboard gear measuring instrumentation to verify results before offloading the part. With the advent of high-precision measuring equipment, elemental measurements provide a better understanding of gear accuracy over composite measurements. For this reason, this course is dedicated almost solely to an explanation of chart interpretation of elemental measurements.